Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG4 Re, and welcome back to Sons of the Forest. Today we are going to be working on the bedroom. I'm going to be working on the little um, balcony area here. I'm going to be, I'm not going to be building dormers, but I'm going to set up the dormers so they're ready to go when I do want to build them. And yeah, it should be pretty fun. I may, I'll probably even make a bed. Probably make a bed. I want to get some better sleep um, during the night. But first things first, we have a problem with Kelvin. So I feel like Kelvin sometimes starts under, underneath the buildings and he kind of works his way out. I don't even know how he gets out, but he usually gets out. And that's, you know, it is what it is. I mean, it's a little bit of a hiccup in the game. What are you going to do? But that is not the case right now. The case right now is Kelvin is trapped in an area right here. Now, this is my fault. This is not the game's fault. This is on me. That's a perfectly fine place for Kelvin to be. Um, he's on the ground. I've just enclosed the area, which is a bit of a problem. Honestly, I don't have a good solution for it. But I do want to get him out of there uh, first and foremost because I do want to, like, have him do some work. So let's see if we can get him out like that. All right, you're going to follow me. And let's see if we can get him out of here. Might have just have to tear down the whole thing, which is going to... I don't think I can make stairs on there. I mean, I don't see how I can make stairs on there if I'm going to be perfectly honest with you guys. Uh, let me go grab some logs and see if there's a way I can do it. But with the, you know, logs on the sides the way they are, I, I don't know, man. I simply do not know. Let's just kind of grab this over here and see what we can do. Yeah, see, I'm not even sure how you would make stairs here. So, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Might just have to tear that whole thing out. Ugh, I really don't want to do that. I guess I really don't have a choice. Um, I don't know what to do about this. I really don't. Um, I could put floors down there and just... I really don't want to, though. I, I like it. I like it the way it is. I don't want to change it. Darn it. Ugh. Okay, well... Let's see if we can get him out of there. Oh, I can't even move those. Is that because of these? Oh, it's gonna... No, you know what? You know what, Kelvin? You can stay under there. Work your way out or not. Like... Maybe I'll get him out of there at some point, but I just, I like this setup too much. I really do. And it's kind of annoying. And I could put floors over there, but then the setup won't be as cool if it has floors over there. Calvin, you could stay there for all I care, you big dummy. <laughs> I, just can't, I just can't deal with it, you know? I don't, even, I don't know what I could do to keep him out of there without, like, changing my build. I could just put floors down, but if you have floors down through here, the, the, the railings don't make any sense. So I don't, I don't like any of the solutions. So he's gonna stay there for a while. Let's uh, let's get some stones up top. Get this, uh, get this show on the road. Yeah, I don't know if any are gonna fall through the floor. I hope not. I have some plans on how to deal with that if I need to. But yeah, let's just get all these up there. We gotta get the um, the first part of the chimney done, so I could actually build the bed and everything and start really figuring out where what's gonna go where. Now, I'm not building the dormers today, but um, I, I do want to, like, leave area for the dormers. Like, you know, like, okay, this is going to be the dormer. Uh, we need to set it up so I can build the dormers, even though I won't. The one set of dormers is already set up. The other ones, uh, not so much. Yo, get a bunch of stuff up there. I think this is day 98. So, three more days of winter. Or, or two full days, I guess. Is it 98 or 97? Let me take a look. Oh, it is day 98. Okay. All right, sounds like those logs might be falling to the first floor. Yep. Kind of. Let's just put... Did they fall? No, no. None fell. I'm going to just put these here for now. How am I going to get up here? I'll just get up from the front. This is a temporary thing. It's just so stuff doesn't fall down there. So let's take care of that. Uh, let's get this out of the way. And these are the dormers. These dormers are set up properly, right? Yeah. Okay. So what we need to do is we need to set this up over here as well. Okay. Um, it honestly shouldn't be that hard. Let, let's get let's take care of the dormers first, and then we don't have to worry about that. That we need some more logs. Let's get rid of these stones, and then we'll do the dormers. Am I gonna put am I gonna put windows in all of these? I you know the idea of a window would let the heat in, but it would also let the smoke in. So I don't know. I, I might get rid of the window. Like will he is um rock a good insulator? Will it really block a lot of the heat? I, I know in this game it doesn't matter, but I'm I'm thinking about like, you know, like real life. 
Sounds like there's something going on outside. You hear that? Hmm. You know what? I don't think I'm gonna worry about it. I'm really hoping Kelvin, like, just magics his way out of that area. Because I've had him stuck under my house before, and he just all of a sudden popped out. So I'm hoping he can get out of there, but man, if he can't, that's going to really suck. Although, to be fair, I've had that spot over there for a long time, and this has never been an issue till now. So maybe this is just a one-off thing. And maybe he's been down there before, and, and he popped out, and I just never noticed. Very well could be the case. So sleeping through the night got him unstuck. Which is just phenomenal. I really didn't want to have to break that, like, building area I have back there. Uh, and you know what? I've had that building area back there for quite a long time. And it's never been an issue that I've noticed. So, um, I don't think it's going to be an issue moving forward either. So, we're going to go ahead and make some Greg. I did get attacked during the night. So, I have a lot of body parts. So, we're going to go ahead and make some Greg. And then I'm going to I get it to work. We, uh, the chimney's done up top, by the way. I still need to finish it on this level. But it is done up top, which is just great. Just grand. And let's go ahead and put a couple legs, a couple of arms. Oh, no. Is that arm no good? Oh, hold on. I think that arm might be bad. Hold on. Let me take a look. Yep. Okay. Well, if you ever have a, a bad limb and you want to still cook with it, uh, just go ahead and put a stick down and then put the limb on the stick and then take it off the stick. It will instantly go back to normal. There we go. That's not the arm. There we go. And now we should have the arm back. Piece of cake. Yeah, look at that. Cool. Make me some Greg, bro. Someone's been telling me to eat the G-berries just straight up. And I've started doing that. <laughs> uh, you know, honestly, the jam and the liquid battery are, are they're kind of trash, in my opinion. Uh, so, might as well just eat this stuff straight up. Can you hold more than 10? Yes, you can. Okay, we're not going to be getting any more because it's winter. So what I do is I just grab that and you just, you hold down the button too. And if you hold down the button, it, it's not even like it takes all, all that long. But it doesn't give you much. But uh, I don't know. I, I wonder one swig of Greg and then just holding down the button and see how long each food animation takes. You know, and then take it from there. I don't know. You have to, you have to hold a lot of those berries though. That's the thing. Anyway, it's pretty cool. Nice way to get a food source. It does give you one of everything. It gives you it gives you thirst, food, and your um, uh, I don't know what you call it, sleep meter, stamina bar, uh, whatever you want to call it. That's what it gives you. Let's go ahead and open this up again. All right, it's all looking good out here. I'm, I'm so glad he's back, man. Like, <laughs> I really need him. Like, he's he's freaking key. Your key, bro. Your key. So let's go see what I've got going on up here. That and yep, look, it's all done. See, now I am gonna put windows in here just because I think they look cool. So let's go ahead and do that now. Um, yeah, there we go. Window, window. Then we gotta go go down and get those stones too. Window, window number two, window numeral dos. I want to make the bed right now. I think I'm going to hold off. I'm going to make the bed the last minute because I want to make sure I know where the bed's going to go because you can't move this bed and it's really kind of irritating. You can't move the bed. Uh, so I want to make sure I know where it's going to go. I mean, I kind of know where it's going to go. I think it's going to go in the same spot it went in last time. I think it's going to go right here, but I'll, I'm going to hold off and just kind of wait and, and see. If I'm eating the G-berries, it's not like my, uh, my tiredness meter. Again, I'm not sure what to call it. Uh, it's not really going to be an issue. The moon, the moon meter. There we go. Grab that. Is that all of it? Uh, almost. It seems like it's all of it. All right, cool. So next thing we need to do is get some logs up there. We need a lot of logs up there. Maybe I should have him doing logs. And I got, I got kind of a lot of logs here as it is, but I want him to get the stone because, well. We should probably have him chop trees. Yeah, let's have him chop trees. Honestly, there's not a lot of stone in the area anyway, so once he's gotten a certain amount of stone, it's like he's gotten, like, pretty much all of it for now. Logs. If he, if he gets any more stone once it's, 
you know, once he's got all the stone in the area, he's really got to go far, and then it's just not really worth it. I feel like slicing something. Yeah, boy. Ex execution! Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Took that punk ass right out. Let's get some more logs up there. It's a pretty cool uh, zipline setup. I was having trouble with this zipline setup because things were not going where they needed to go. Um, but I think we've got it kind of taken care of now. Yeah. Let's get up there and do the outline of what we're going to be doing. Uh, the next thing is going to be the balcony. Okay. So, uh, go right here. That'll go right there. Uh, yeah, this will go across the top. Like that. So, what I'm thinking is, this is what I'm thinking. Oh, <laughs> it's magic. So what I'm thinking is bedroom. This will be the bedroom. Maybe a couple tables or something interesting like that. Um, then this will be like a little like sitting area. And then this will also be like a, a sitting area. Um, this table is too big for this area. So this table will definitely go over here. I just kind of want it out of the way. It's pretty much out of the way. And then we will have this, this, yeah. Uh, I gotta put stuff in there as well. What does I have? No, we need a three quarters log for that, don't we? I'm pretty sure that's a three quarters log. Let's try a half log though. I'm, I'm pretty sure this isn't, no, there's no way. Yeah, there's no way. I'm not even gonna bother. All right. Um. So how do we wanna handle this? I mean, I could put this over here, block it. Or I could just put these like this. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I think I'm going to do it like this. We should be able to take this out as well. And this as well. Cool. Yeah, that looks good. And then these could be halves. Halvesies. Actually, I think that might have turned into a, into a quarter log. So let's go ahead and turn this into a quarter log. Yep, yep. Okay, that's good. We'll do the same thing on the other side. And then for this, we'll just put logs around here. There'll be a little dory right here. And that is this is going to be the most epic balcony ever. I love it. Sounds like you got a problem out here. Something I'm going to have to go deal with myself. They don't want they don't want none of this. They really don't. Look at you. Look at you. Look at you now. Oh, how's your arm? Can I lend you a hand? <laughs> It's freaking that's right you bet you better think twice pal you better think twice he's thinking about it he's like i don't know this might not be the best idea but my people want me to come in so i guess i gotta do it and there he goes that was brutal that was the, that's some that might be the most brutal thing i've seen yet look at this look at this guy unbelievable i i tried to tell you did I not try to tell you? I'm pretty sure I tried to tell you. You don't listen. You don't freaking listen. And look at you. Look at you now. You cockroach. Oh my goodness. These freaking people. Like, <laughs> unbelievable. Unreal. I gotta continue working on the wall, too. I haven't made the wall high enough. I feel pretty safe, so. You know, it's just like, yeah. I'll get to it eventually. <laughs> Maybe. All right, where, where did we leave off? Oh yeah, more logs. And we are just about done with this spot. Check it out, looking good. Um, there's one other thing I would like to do that I didn't quite think about. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to do it. Um, there's a, I should be able to. I wanna take out some of these uh, uh, platforms above. You know what, instead of just talk, instead of talking in riddles, I'll just wait until I get over there and I'll show you what I mean. I'm just gonna throw these over here in case I need them for something else. There we go. I won't put the door on there just yet. But yeah, these right here. Oh, oh why is that one there? Mm -hmm. Interesting. So can I get rid of these? I should be able to. I don't think they need to be there. But I can't. Hmm. All right, I'm going to need a 
these and that's not gonna help me get up there i'm not really sure how to get up there um let's take one of these and jump on it and see if i can get up there oh you know i can just build these up yeah i want to I like you see how like this thing right here this thing i want to take that out so let's see let's see if we can come on man stay on the freaking logs dude there you go. Yes, I can. All right, cool. Figured I could. It's gonna be a little bit messy, but that's okay. <laughs> a little bit messy. How about really messy? <laughs> Clear some of this stuff out of there. And let's get this thing out of here. So I guess I could just do the, the same thing on the other side, right? Throw these over here for now. Yep. Cool. Take that out. Now we're gonna build these up on the other side and do the same thing. And get that. Get that out of there. I'm really glad I could. I figured I could. I just, you know, you never know with these building mechanics. Like sometimes you think you do something, and, you know, you're kind of wrong, <laughs> and you can't. But this one worked out for me. Um, okay, so now I'll have to put some logs underneath. Let's kind of throw these over here. Put these underneath. Don't need there anymore? Cool. Now can I? Nope. Gotta put another one. I hear something. I hear something. I'm not sure if it's an enemy or not. You hear that? I don't see anything. I don't see any traps set off or anything. I see a lot of logs out there. I don't know where the hell Bonehead is. Hey! Hey! Jackass, what are you doing? Let's see what's going on with this guy. Is he trapped again? I bet you he's trapped again. Let's go ahead and put some more wood on this. And let's see if we can find this guy. Oh, no, he's not trapped. Okay, he's, he's kind of trapped. He's a little bit, you know... He gets stuck on things all the time. Hey, what are you going to do? It'll eventually work itself out. So the balcony is looking super dope. I just don't know what I want to put in here. You know, I almost feel like just building a wall there. Like, what could I put in that little spot that would make sense? I mean, really nothing. No, I, I can't think of a damn thing. You don't want to put chairs over there. You don't want to sit there because you know, you're going to be bumping your head. Um, I, I mean, You don't want to put a table. You know what? No. No, I'm going to cover those up. We've got the logs. We might as well. It'll make a nice more... It'll make a much more square, better looking building. And, and, and uh, in real life, you don't leave your, you know, your roofs exposed like that. You know, build stuff around them and everything. So that's... Yeah, this looks a lot better. Hell yeah, it does. So what kind of stuff am I going to put out here? I definitely want a place to sit and a table. A place to sit, a table. Maybe I'll put a couple of, uh, you know... Uh, plant grower things not that i'm really gonna be growing plants out here but just for the you know just to make it cool out here i don't know let's take a look all right we don't want any wooden chairs um we don't want bone chairs we want these chairs i gotta start killing some more deer man like i don't have a lot of but these are these are the only chairs that matter uh let's put down the bed first actually not the bed i don't know why i thought of the bed i mean a table put down a table uh, the round table's too big that table is the only other table, right? Okay. Uh, I don't want to put that. So it's right in the middle? On the side? Uh, yeah, I kind of want to put the table over here. I don't want to block the balcony. All right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put the table right there. And the idea is if you want to sit over here, you could like sit over here. If you want to sit over here, you could sit over here. And it doesn't block the balcony. Yeah, that, that that's that's definitely the best way to go. And then we're gonna need some chairs. I usually like to put the chairs like they're kind of not like tucked in or whatever. Um, oh, if I put a chair over here, you're not gonna be able to get to the balcony. All right, I'm gonna put a chair on this side only. This is where you sit. Anyway, I like to put the chairs like they're kind of like pushed out, you know, uh, almost like someone just got up or you know whatever. All right, so that's good. It's a nice place to eat. Good view. I like it. And then. 
What else do I want to put in here? Let's put a put a bench. I haven't made a bench yet. Yeah, bench seems very uncomfortable. I think we're past the bench the bench stage. Um, do I have a lot of uh, cloth? Yeah, not really, but I have enough. And we're gonna need lights out here. Oh, maybe I could use um the skull lamps out here. I've got some over here. Seems don't give off enough light though, but. I don't know, maybe the idea of, like, not giving enough, enough light would be pretty cool. It'd be at atmospheric out here. And we'll have them face this way. Actually, put it as low as you can. And then we'll put another one on the other side. And atmospheric lighting, you know? You don't want to overdo it, I guess. And then we'll have this one face this way. Alright, that's nice. All right, cool. So we'll, we'll hold off and we'll just use those um, those skull lamps. Unless it's really... Unless they just won't do well enough. Maybe we can put a, a trophy head out here. Yeah, let's put a trophy head out. Oh, yeah, right there. Okay, so... Now, how do we do this? Okay. Um, I wish we could get trophies for something more dangerous. Because, like, these are just, like, you know... I'm not going to... I'm not going to put... The, raccoon, my, the raccoons are my buddies. I guess we'll put the deer head up there. Yeah, the raccoons are my buddies. The fact that I have a head bothers me. I'm just going to assume someone else killed them. All right, what's next? Let's go ahead and put a wall planter up. Yep, that looks good right there. I like it. Uh, maybe a little lower. Works for me. Starting to get a little busy out here. We can't put too much more out here. I don't know what else we put out here. There's not enough decorations in the game, right? Uh, furniture is the furniture the only decoration yeah furniture is the only decoration type stuff i don't feel like you get enough you know what else can i put out here you guys let me know in the comments am i missing anything obvious out here in the meantime we'll just build this out no not that we need some half logs another half log and those are full um, log. So I'm, I'm going to take from here because this is going to be a this is going to be a, um, a a dormer at some point. So all right, cool. And now this we're getting a lot of sticks, man. A lot of freaking sticks. Kind of boil me up some water. Freaking thirsty. And I just saw some babies outside, so we got to go take a look at this. See what's going on. Actually, I didn't really see him. Kelvin pointed him out to me. Good old Kelvin. Hey, guys. Where's the babies? Oh, did this one get killed? Yes, it did. All right, cool. Dude, there better not be logs over here. Dude, there's logs right here, you jackass. What the hell is wrong with this guy? All right, you know what I'm going to do? This is what I'm going to do. This is what we're going to do. I'm going to beat Kelvin to an inch of his life. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> I have a bunch of logs over here. He's not getting them for some reason. So I'm going to find out where they are. This is what, this has been my, my MO now. I go to where the logs are and then I simply hit a tree and I put them somewhere inside my base and then he'll see them at that point and he'll grab them. Take care of business. There we go. Looking good. All right, that's good. Now, once there's logs over there, we simply wait for that one to finish. And then we grab this off the tree. Reload. And do the same thing over here. Get them in the in the base somewhere. What, what the hell is the problem here? What is what is the problem? There we go. Perfect. Actually, what I like to do is I like to put this away because it makes things slower. There we go. Nope. Okay. I thought that would be a problem. That's fine. That's fine. Not a huge problem. What we're going to do is we're just going to chop this one down too. I've just been called out and I accept the challenge. Oh, look at this guy. Must have jumped over the wall. And he's dead. And he's gone. Yeah, the thing is, I got to get that wall higher. <laughs> like... Ugh. I don't know why I'm not doing it. Uh, because it's just kind of boring to, <laughs> to build up the wall. I should. 
but I'm not. Right, everything else looks good out here. I, I heard a female voice, but she must have got herself killed on a trap. All right, so we are working on the bed now. So let's come on up here and see what we got. Hold on. Yeah, how are we doing over there? Oh, those are full. Okay. Maybe that's why he wasn't grabbing any more logs, because those are full. I don't know. All right, so here's the bed. You know the drill. Oh, the bed only takes two. Oh, it must be the couch that takes all the all the deer hide. I, I was like, something takes a lot of deer hide. I thought it would be the bed, but I don't know. It seems to be the, the couch. Would a couch take? I guess. This, it would depend on the, the, you know, how big the couch is, I guess, but. All right. Take care of this. Oh, okay. What are those? Uh, yeah, those are halves. Okay. So, good. I'm going to take these out of here since this will be a dormer. Oh, I don't like that. What did I just take? I hope I just took it from the top. Boom. Boom. Like that. And that. And the same thing over here. That one's already gone. Um, okay. I guess I'll use a log then. For the last one. Uh, I need a full log though. These are all halves and quarters and stuff. I probably should go through them. And organize them. And maybe put them somewhere and use them. I, I don't care. I don't care. Alright, a few more sticks. And here they are. Beautiful. Come on, get in there. And we now have a proper bed again. Almost. We're almost there. And where do I keep the animal skin? Right here. Is that all of it? Dude, I only have five. Like, hold on. Let me see how much the couch is going to take. Couch takes... Yes, yeah, six. My goodness. Okay, well, is that really all that I have? I feel like I should have more than that. So I only have four. Which means I'm going to have to go kill some deer. Oh, no, there's more over here. Okay, I was going to say, I thought I had more somewhere. All right, cool. So I got plenty. And there we go. That's looking good. Let's go ahead and finish this. Put the door... Actually, before we put the door in here, let's go in here and say... Yep, everything's done in here. Nice little... Nice balcony, man. I, I think it came out pretty good. All right, and I think we want these... To yeah. Grab that so we don't lose it. Or, you know. Alright, cool. Uh, you know what? I think we're gonna have to call this one here. I was hoping to get I was hoping to get everything done up here, but honestly, we got actually I take that back. We got everything done I wanted to get done. Uh so the next order of business will be Um setting up the couch and everything. Oops. Hold on. Yeah, the next order of business will be to set up the couch. I don't know where I'm going to put it. I kind of want to put the couch over here, but there's a lot of room over here to be used. So I, I can't, I can't just leave this completely open. I also need to finish these walls, uh, make some dormers, a lot of work to do, but I'm really happy with what we got done today. And I do think I'm going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.